Saka Fetch YouTube and welcome back to my channel. Guys, it's so nice showing my face on here. I know a lot of you always complain why Terry Ann is not showing her face. But the thing is, it's not that I don't want to, but most times when I film these videos, I'm in my pajamas, okay? So today on the menu, we're gonna be making some delicious oven baked salmon. Before you continue, make sure you subscribe to the channel to join the family. You're not gonna regret it, trust me. A lot of people always tell me this. Let's jump into this video. Hello my darlings! Happy New Year! Guys, I've missed you all so very much. Let us make some oven baked salmon. I'm seasoning the salmon side with some oil, some black pepper. I have this gorgeous seasoning that I got from Pound Stretcher and oh my goodness, it works so amazing with fish. This is it. It's a salt, savory, cumin, you know, bay leaf, lemon and everything in there and it is just so, so good. I'm putting a generous amount on there and then I'm gonna put some paprika for color and yes my loves I'm gonna pat that down preheat your oven to 200 degrees Celsius because we're gonna pop that in there for about 20 minutes untouched undisturbed and it will be ready okay I also added some brown sugar just for that extra little you know a little sweetness on the top Once your salmon is seasoned, it should look something like this. I'm putting some lemon slices on the side. You can choose to put it on the top if you want to. However, I just want to put it on the side, but put it on top. Do as you wish. I'm going to now pop it into my oven that's nice and hot for about 20 minutes. Set your timer. 20 minutes is is. I did plan to have this with some rice but I thought you know what let me just have some noodles instead so I had this ready to walk noodles in my fridge as well as some choice some is that how you call it I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right hope I'm not butchering it and yes my loves give it a quick wash and then I'm going to chop it up just going to add a little bit of seasonings to the pot and everything and this noodles will be ready in about five minutes so I sort of started this when it was about 10 minutes into the cook time for the salmon that way I'm not waiting too long and dinner was sort of ready in about 20 minutes max because this year I don't want to be in the kitchen too long I want to give you these nice recipes that doesn't require to be slaving in the kitchen and yes let's get started with this noodles to a pot I'm adding a little oil going with your uh, choice some um, let it saute for about a minute or two and then I'm just gonna go in and add in my soy sauce I'm probably gonna add about three tablespoons of soy sauce a little rice vinegar some honey a little black pepper make sure to check the description box for all of the ingredients that I am using and once all of the um, seasonings was in I actually just went in with my noodles mixed it up make sure you put some freshly grated garlic in there as well like my garlic mints I prefer it grated that way it just disappears and you can't see it but yes mix up the noodles takes about two to three minutes guys literally this was ready in no time keep your heat on high add a little paprika for color if you're feeling fancy yes my darlings this was it already So if you're feeling fancy, you can always just add a little chili flakes, you know, if you want the heat. I added just a little sprinkle, nothing too much. And yes, my loves, this was ready in no more than five minutes. Gorgeous noodles to go with that beautiful salmon. And yes, my loves. But hey, 
um you know off the food just for a little bit guys i know you all missed me very much i missed being in the kitchen however i think it was important that i took a little break just around the holidays my family was over and i just really wanted to enjoy that time with them because i think sometimes we can be so caught up in everything else and then you know family time passes us by so i really wanted to just enjoy that time you know my brother came here for the holidays and we had a very lovely time and yeah this is my salmon all done <laughs> so yes my darlings i really hope you enjoy this easy big salmon recipe and noodles and everything that i have going on I'm just easing my way back into the kitchen yes my love sprinkle with parsley i am gonna go ahead and just cut this up to show you how juicy it's looking and yes so so good so my loves i'd be very happy if you all can just sort of leave me some um feedback in the comments as to what sort of recipes you want from me this year or what sort of things you want to see from me this year i'm always up for some suggestions we're actually en route to 600k and i'm so grateful for all of the support from all of you guys i just appreciate you all so very much i did serve my salmon with the noodles and it was just so so good just a quick little dinner little quick dinner idea for a monday evening no more than 20 minutes and you're all done i really hope you enjoy the recipes it's been a pleasure having you back here in my kitchen i can't wait to bombard you all with new recipes and i'm gonna be leaving a quote at the end of every recipe from now on thank you for watching Bye bye